Hi mums and dads, it's me Dani Jacobs and as always you're having coffee with me on the red couch. Today we're going to discuss resilience, an essential attribute that your kids need to acquire for the 21st century. Life is full of setbacks and developing a thick skin is essential for getting on in life. Every entrepreneur needs resilience and determination to get up when they suffer a blow. Business is fraught with ups and downs. The best entrepreneurs out there can attest to this. I can attest to this. Starting a new business is tough. You're in a rabbit hole for many years. Your cash flow is under pressure and many things look like much more viable alternatives. Parents can cultivate the traits of successful entrepreneurs by taking the sting out of failure and stop teaching that failure is bad. Yes, we all strive for our kids to be the best. Achieving high marks in school, earning first place in sport or winning the science fair are all important and admirable goals. More important, however, is how we teach our kids to fail because they will fail at something and at some point in life. And as most business leaders will tell you, failure is common and indeed necessary on the road to success. In school, we are taught that failure is bad. In the entrepreneurial arena, failure can be a great thing if a positive lesson is learned. Whether in sports, school or social activities, children's early mistakes can help them to prepare for the realities of a business world. Allowing your children to fail will force them to create new ways to accomplish their goals and to learn from their mistakes. This will lead to confident children that can persevere when times are tough. Now as a parent you might ask, how do I teach this? First and foremost, don't live your unmet dreams through your children. It is normally those parents that set a terrible example at failing. We all know them. We see them next to the sporting field. I was confronted with one of these parents at a cycling event a couple of weeks back. Secondly, do not protect your children against failure. In times of failure, it is our responsibility as parents to pick them up, to dust them off, and to turn those failures into teachable moments. When your children fail, Instead of scolding them or punishing them, discuss what factors led to this failure and together brainstorm possible solutions to make sure that this does not happen in future. Always seek the learning lesson in each adversity and encourage your children to never give up. This way they will not dread failure or wallow in pity and defeat when things are not going their way. People who achieve have also failed at something. Patience and persistence are key for success. We need to promote risk taking and allow our kids to take chances, fail and move on. Instead of teaching our children to always strive for perfection, we should encourage them to strive for improvement. As a parent, you influence your child's willingness to try, fail learn and try again. An essential skill for entrepreneurs. It takes a lot of mental strength, courage and perseverance to be an entrepreneur. I hope you enjoyed this session on resilience. I truly believe that resilience are one of the most important attributes that you can teach your children. Go and subscribe to our YouTube channel, go to Facebook, go to website and go and check us out on Instagram. Happy parenting.